Hello brothers and sisters and welcome back to the exciting Australian adventure that is Dinkum. We left off last time when I picked up all of my cash. I did come back out here. I had another barrel here. I just destroyed it real quick while I was kind of cleaning up around here. But look what has been made. We've got ourselves some Waddle Brew. So, I can't remember if we looked at it last on the end of the last episode, but I obviously didn't save because it was a new day. But here's the Waddle Brew. So it looks like we get a one-star boost to mining and uh, lumbering, whereas we get a normal boost to fishing for 10 minutes. So this is actually a really good item. What I want to see next, though, are these jellies, because we can put these jellies in here. Boop. I can't wait to see what that's going to get us next. Ooh, a couple little bit of bones. Thank you, my little friend. I wish I could, like, pet you, sir. I wonder... Shh, shh. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Ah! Hold on. I got a plan. I don't need you to stay in it for long. There we go. There's our new farm dog, everybody. I wonder... I don't know if it'll make a difference if I release him, but... There we go. Look, you're released, my friend. There's our farm dog. He will protect our cheeky little chooks at night. And let's just make this farm even crazier. Come here, little turkey. Oops, that was a terrible trap drop. Thank you. Throw you in here. You guys might get out. I don't actually know. All right. There we go. I don't think that'll do anything, but it's pretty fun. At, at the end of the day, that's what we're trying to do, right? We're trying to have a little bit of fun around here. All right, I've got a new farm dog. That farm dog will be... I don't know. Put a name down in the comment what we should call the farm dog, and hopefully he stays there every day. I'll grab the egg out of here. Put the feed in. And let's continue through. So I'm trying to think of what I want to be doing next. Obviously, we've got our visitor home here. I got to kind of get a handle on things because we had a wonderful live stream on Friday. And if you were there, thank you all so much for showing up. I had a really good time. Uh, but we did a co-op stream. So I'm trying to get a game at like a handle on where I was at. So Fletch, I swear I saw something fall out of the sky. Yeah, we'll go check that out because we got like electrical parts out of that. Fletch, you got anything for me? Let's see. I'm working on deep mining. So that's where all of my points are going to go next, I'm going to say. And Vombats will be nice. Building license and a vehicle license. Yeah. The rest are just nice to have. And we're all out. So we just need people to start showing up. We've been very unlucky with the people showing up. When we did the live stream, we had rain come by three or four days in a row. It was pretty insane to say the least. I knew they were going to eat one of the feeds. There we go. Let's plop these back in here. Let's get our day going. What time is it? It's 9 a.m. Let's go see Johnny Boy real quick. What's up, bros? Actually, hold on. I got a. I don't remember if I had all of these in the museum or not. Wait, yeah, I have the museum. Getting turned around here. All right, let's go see if we can put some more stuff in our museum. I'm interested in seeing. What, what shows up on that left pedestal over there? It looks like after either after a little bit amount of time or after a few donations, the camera comes out. Okay, we've got all these, so we can sell all this. So I'm interested to see what will come out on the left-hand side. Look at that doggo. He's such a good boy. All right, let's go see John. This is all like completely backwards to what me and Mr. Twigs did Friday, so I'm getting turned. Okay, sell. I've got so many things, I don't even care. What is that? A chicken egg. Sell all that. Let me just sell this to get it out of my way. And that's good. Thanks thanks for the chump change, boss. Appreciate you. Did I buy a torch? I'm pretty sure I bought a torch. All right, let's get a move on here. So there's really nothing... Um, painstaking the do for the day. So why don't we take a request from both John and Fletch? What do you want? Ulysses Butterfly. All right, we'll be on the lookout. And then our friend over here. 
Uh, let's chat. Need anything? You have a mining license. Rustle up a tin bar, you got it. You know what we can do? Why don't we build our own house finally, too? We've got plenty of cash, so let's talk about my house. <coughs> 95,000 upfront free, and once you've applied for the deed, you will have to source the construction materials myself. So you're interested? Yep. I like how I have to pay for my own stuff, but then when the villagers come in, we can put the debt towards the town. The cheap bastards. Oh, it's just gonna build it right here. Okay. Put that there. So what do I need? So I just need some tin sheets, nails, and gumwood planks. I should probably have most of that. Yep, we've got gumwood right here. We've got tin sheets. Oops. Tin sheets, and we need some nails. So why don't I take this? Let me take some of these tin sheets. Let me turn some of these into bars. Yeah. We'll get a few bars out of that. I will come over here and turn this batch into nails. And then from the bars we get from there, we'll use that to give it to Fletch for our daily achievement. Construction can begin tomorrow. Thank you very much. Let's go find a booter fly. Let's go put all our stuff away for the day. We'll put that away, put that away. We get that and that in here. Go put our food and flowers away. Egg, all this stuff. I'm going to keep that with me in case we do a little bit of mining on the way back. I do want to start getting decorative with everything. Got traps with me. Like I said, I want to start getting decorative, and I'm thinking we're going to go with the brick floors. So with that in mind... Hello. Not quite sure how to tell the difference just yet. So that one's got like white spots and I'm missing every shot. The blue moon butterfly, blue with some white spots on it. Pretty sure that was just a fly. There's another fly over here. I don't really care about flies. Nope, definitely don't care about flies right now. I can see a booter fly. We can see quite a few of them. So this is a Jezebel. The Scarlet Jezebel. I'm pretty sure this was one too. Yep. Scarlet Jezzy. One over here. This could either be the Blue Moon or the Ulysses. Looks like a Blue Moon to me. We'll drop those if we uh, run out of space while we're doing this. Oh, I saw a leaf fly through the air and I thought it was a butterfly. There's something else over here. So I'm going to be on the lookout for a butterfly. And uh, I'm going to make my way to the tropics. I'm going to do a little banana farming today. I'm also coming up to the crash site that Fletch had told us about with the bulletin board today. Got some chickens. So I've been hunting the, the turkeys throughout the day. And obviously grabbing a little bit of whatever I can. So let's mine this out. Of course, I'm up here because I want to get the bananas too. So the last time we broke this, we got like... A, a small handful of green chips, which was nice. So it looks like green boards and some hot cylinders this time. So those are those are all very good options. That's probably an eel-tailed catfish over there in the water. So yeah, like I said, I've been killing these guys because I want to get the drumsticks. Can use these for decent food. They're also very easy to farm out. And also, I'm pretty sure there's a, a nice mid-tier recipe later down the road that'll use these as well. So I want to make sure to have some on hand for that, of course. And also, if I see some good old Cooper, we're going to make sure to grab that on the way. Quite the haul obtained today. So I've got 37 raw drumsticks, 42 nanners, a shit ton of butterflies and swallows and whatnot. A single tin sheet. And yeah, the rest is just kind of whatever. I also got 12 Cooper, which is good. It's better than nothing, but I got to wait until tomorrow to sell because I got back home so late. That's fine. It's not a big deal to me. I'm going to go in here, see what we can donate, however. I have a donation. All right, so we can give him a swallowtail. Yep, take it. Give me some permit points. Thank you. 
take a Tau Emerald Dragonfly. Perfect. So now all these basic ones, I can try to remember that he has them. So like the Harlequin, the Swallowtail, the Scarlet Jezebel, the Fly, obviously the Blue Moon, the most common. I thought I had one more, but nope, I guess not. That was just a bunch of them. So the tropics are good for all of those creatures, of course, because that's where I spent most of my day today was in the tropics. Now what I'm going to do is we're going to use the rest of my stamina today. I'm going to go chop rocks. Take a look at our orchard here. I'm going to make our orchard better as well as we go. Give it a little more definition and uh, sustainability and just aesthetic. But for now, it'll do. It may even come to the point where I chop a few down, unfortunately, to try and like change up the the layout because so i did just kind of throw those down quickly as possible just so i could get them ready but yeah right now i want to just use our stamina or the rest of this pick whichever comes first so i can make um a bunch of stone pads so i'm going to replace the wood ones that we put down and put stone in instead or brick just because it looks phenomenal and you'll see what is that is that a moth A bogong moth. And yeah, don't forget, different creatures come out at night, so... If you're out there trying to, like, tent... Like, uh... Actively trying to complete that museum. Get out at night, get out early morning. Get out there when the weather's different. All sorts of factors change which bugs and which fish are out. Okay, I'm gonna grab this. Sorry, bro, I didn't get your Ulysses butterfly, so... But Fletch... I do have your tin bar. Here you go, bud. Bam. Take it, friend. What do you got for me? Ninja pants? Oh, baby. Sent it to my mailbox. So I was full. Did I sell my ninja shirt at some point by mistake, or did I put it away? I may have sold it. Ninja shirt. We're going to have to take that out. We are absolutely going to have to take that out and uh, just be ninjas. All right, so bam, bam, bam. I ended up having enough tin for three because we found a little bit more tin in the rocks. And in here, is there anything I can even put in here? I could put the rocks in here temporarily, but I'm going to just turn those into, into roads in a bit anyway. So let's just go inside, dump these in. Just to clear up a little bit of space. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the most fun part of the game. And we're going to go cook a bunch of nanners and drumsticks. Now, I know I could save the nanners for uh, making fruit salads, but I need a good cheap food to eat throughout the day. And honestly, nanners are it. They replenish so much stamina. And they satisfy you for quite a little bit of time, if you know what I mean. So I'm going to cook up these drumsticks tonight, become a... Grill master extraordinaire. And then I'm going to do the same thing with the bananas, the drumsticks, and I think that's really it. Yep. And then we'll go to bed. Then we'll go to bed, start the next day. End of a new day here. You can see hunting. We leveled up to 17 or 16, almost 17. Got bug catching nearly to 10. Foraging's getting up there. Mining is 15. We made 14,000 dinks today. Not a terrible day. Wasn't uh, us trying to get money. Franklin's here. Oh my god, he's the research guy. We gotta go. We got shit to do today. What's this? Homemaker? From tent to house to even bigger house, here is a milestone for upgrading your home. Perfect. So, I also... Fletch! Here's the ninja pants. Oh, I never deleted it. I also sold the scrub turkey that was sitting... That I put in my fence, fenced-in area because I figured I'd like 4,200 gold more. Look, our dog's still here, though. Hey, bud. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Grab this egg. All right, let's go see our boy, but first check the board. Compost. You're making compo compost. If anyone brings me four Rupu, I'll give them three fertilizer. Yep. Yep. I don't have. I don't know how to make fertilizer yet, so... Um, where's my Rupu? Right there. One, two, three, four. Thank you. Let's go see Fletch. Fletch, I got some shit for you. Let's chat. I complete your request. Here you go. Here's three fertilizer. Appreciate you. <clears throat> Hopefully we learn to make it soon. 
What can you do for me? Let's chat. Uh, got a job. Get a login license. Four gum logs. That's super easy. You got it. Hello. Uh, let's talk about my house. I want to see what the next update is. So you want to talk about your home? I want to upgrade, change the look. I want to upgrade. 220. Okay. Maybe later. Good to know. And then what can we do about the look of the house? So about my house. I want to change the look. <gasps> okay. Okay. Hold on. I'm digging this one. We'll get a purple house, trim color, white, black, darker purple just looks silly. We'll do white. How about a silvery color? Kind of blends in too much. Go back to the main color here a bit deep all right we'll go for that washed out look the roof the roof the roof is on fire okay what styles do we got these look like sheds <gasps> oh actually i kind of like that that works for me door this is looks quaint and then the window I'm going to go with the arch. Okay. Oh, look at our... Oh, my God. There's hedges, too. Look at this thing. It's beautiful. I mean, it, oh, it's bigger than my tent, too. That's nice. I wasn't sure how much bigger than my tent it would be. Sick. All right. Let's go see our boy. And before I forget, I'll cut down a gum tree real quick so I can get those logs for our friend Fletch. Grab that, grab the seeds, because we'll make a gum tree farm at some point in time. Ah, look at them. Visitor site, eight to four. What's up, Frankie? Yeah. Yes? Oh, I need to bring him discs. Let's go grab our discs. Bring our discs. Actually, let me ask him what he wants first. That way, if he wants clothing, I can grab some. Do not waste my time. So I'm super excited to eventually get a jackhammer, but to do that, I'm going to need eight iron. So I definitely need to get the... Uh, the deep mines first, which is, we're almost there anyway, so I'm not too worried about it. I can't wait to see what this gotcha machine is, too. I just love gotcha, so I'm all for it. A lawnmower is cool. Definitely a motorbike. What do we need for that? Just iron is the only thing on that list. Cool. Seems like iron's, like, pretty close. All right. What do you have here for me? Buy a wooden sign? Yep. I'll take it. Okay. And what's this? A repair kit? Just to repair all your damaged tools at a repairable table. That is expensive. I'm not paying 30 grand for it, but that's an expensive buy, my friend. I need to get him happy. I forgot to ask him what he wanted. I was too excited about these discs again. Or maybe I... Oh, you know what? He was just here the other day, so I didn't actually... I haven't gone out gathering again, so I don't have any discs. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, well. That's also fine. That is fine. Oh, look, our thing dug up another piece of salvage. I'm full. I'm going to go sell the John. Actually, no, I'm not going to sell just in case he asks for something in my inventory. Let's be smart about this. Frankie, what can I get for you today? I want to chat. Need anything? Four palm wood planks. Yeah, I'll do that. Simple. I love easy. All right, let's go see our boy, John. It's 9 o'clock. He's got an iron bar over there. All right, we're going to sell him all of our bugs. I'm even going to sell him that because I've got plenty of them. And is that good? Yes. I want to see what a fertilizer sells for. Probably, like, nothing, though. Just one of these. What do you sell for? 172. That's what I, th that's what I figured. Freaking rip off. I don't need this yet. I'm going to hold off. I'm going to buy all the tools because I want to get start getting backups here. So if I break my tools so late in the night, I have extra tools just sitting in a sitting in a chest for me. And then also when I get quests like dailies to make a tool, I can just upgrade the tools. What do you want for this piece of iron? Four grand? Yeah, I'll buy it. Thank you. 
I'm trying to save my money here, though. I want to make sure I've got enough to buy our friend a home. So he wants four palm wood planks. I forgot to ask Johnny Boy what he wanted for the day. Hi. Uh, let's chat. Here you go. Easy task. I don't even have to process them. What do you got for me? Retro point glasses? Heck yeah. Give me... Where are you? Right there. Oh, baby. This is the ninja outfit, by the way. Full ninja. I'm just going to go ask John what he wants. Got a job? He's already at almost three hearts. Hankering for a prime roast? I'll say yes, but... Is that just a cooked prime? Cooked prime meat? No, that's definitely like an actual thing. Prime roast. A potato, carrot, kale, green bean, and a pumpkin. You, sir, can go suck an egg. And I've got one right here for you. Suck it. All right, let's go give our boy Franklin here his palm planks. I want to chat. Here you go. Yep. I feel like he's going to be like one of the harder ones to get to move into the city. Ooh, a white bedside table. Thank you, sir. Uh, let's chat. Let's talk. If enough information is collected, anything can be accurately done, even the weather. Thank you. All right, that's him for the day. That's unfortunate, but, you know, I'm glad he came. I definitely need to go do some uh, farming runs for discs. Otherwise, I just need to start putting shit away. Uh, put these in here. Oh, I got the rocks, too. Palm. So, the rocks can be used here, and this is what I was talking about, making rock paths. Just gonna make these until I run out of rocks. There we go. So if I take that, there you are. Can I just put you right over these? I can't. Do I have to use a shovel? <laughs> Let me get rid of this. Oh, you know what? I might just be able to, nope. Yeah, I gotta dig all this up. So I'm gonna dig these up and I'll put the rock paths down to show you why I like them so much. Only took a quick moment for that, so, but look at this. It looks so nice, this rocky path. So I'm thinking, like, maybe on the outskirts, I'm going to use these rock paths. And then for the main portion, we use these right here, the brick path. So I like the rock paths for certain things because these just look so nice, right? But for the most part, we're going to use brick for, like, our main areas. I think I might stick with rock to, like, outskirts. So I'm probably actually going to switch this out for brick to get to John's house. And also all the inners. But then I'll make a rock path going over this way to our guest cabin. And then maybe a rock path once we exit the museum as well. I've got enough permit points now so we can unlock the deep mining. So let's head in here. Let's go talk to our buddy Fletch. I'm going to apply for a license. And I want way up here deep mining. All right. Deep mining level one. Okay, I was expecting to see like level two here, but maybe it's not available in the in the early access yet or it's coming soon. You know, I like I just haven't gotten there. Okay, cool. So we've got that, and I wanted to make sure that I did this now before later because I am wanting to come in here and snatch up the mining pass. A one-time pass to use a mine elevator. That'll be 25 grand, okay? So now I'm wondering if I build this myself. Um, let's talk about the town. Can I see the deeds? And a mi a deep mine. All right. Yep. So I'm going to need not much, honestly. It's pretty simple right there. Two keys. It'll cost 250K in debt, which is fine. We want this. Yep. Let's get the mining deed. And we'll get everything placed in there. I might need to grab a little more tin, which, you know what? Just in case I do. 
Where's my tin sheets? I'm just gonna take these and just smelt some real quick. Okay. Now let's throw the deep mine down. So how big is it? It's not big. Question is, where do I want the mine? <clears throat> like, should I put it next to the museum? Like, it's kind of an attraction. And that's why the museum was there. Or should we kind of put it off canter a bit? No, I'm going to put it off canter a bit. Like, we got to get out there. So if this will be where we have our roads. And I'm going to build a road out this way to my house. We'll have a road going down here towards the pasture. This way, going across here, we'll build a bridge. And here will be the deep mine. I want it right here. Out of my way. Okay. So let's plop this thing right there. Yep. And let me grab all these things. So. So I'm going to need gears, engine keys, tin cooper, cement. All right, we drop our last piece of cement in here. All right, and construction will begin tomorrow. And if it's like anything else in the game besides our house, I'm going to assume that construction will start tomorrow and then it'll finish the next day. So that means in the next episode, we will go and see what's in the deep mines and see how much big money is going to be there. I'm going to prepare in those next two days by buying two pickaxes, turning them into uh, copper pickaxes. So that way we can go down with that. I have all my bananas. I'm going to go down with my cooked drumsticks and we're also going to use this when we go down there because we get that boost to mining so i think we're going to be sitting very pretty so if you want to see that make sure you are subscribed double check down below and if you're not make sure you do hit it and hit the bell so you do find your way back here for that next episode and as usual we're going to wrap this up here because we got a lot done today i think we're pretty good I just need to build... I wanted to go farm stone, but now that I've got the deep mine, I don't really want to waste the pickaxes because I don't know how many I'm going to need down there or how many I can force with a one-day pass of 25,000. I need to make that worth it. So I'm going to do as much as possible. So, all right, guys, as usual, this has been Shabby Doo, and hope the rest of your day is not too shabby. <laughs>